I'm pleased uh, to participate in this important conference. My report will deal with uh, a retrospective case rate control study on maternal perceived uh, stress in pediatric borderline intellectual functioning. I declare no conflict of interest. So, summary, uh, I will talk about the borderline intellectual functioning definition, the classification that this condition has had uh, over time. And currently, as in the DSM, it's a pathogenesis. I will talk about our study and the experimental data that have emerged. Borderline intellectual functioning is a neuropsychological entity identified as an intelligent quotient that ranges between 71 and 85 points with maladaptive functioning in the academic social and uh, or professional sphere. Indeed, children with the borderline intellectual be, um, functioning show deficit in neurocognitive functioning and adaptive be behavior. The prevalence of this condition is estimated to be uh, between 14 and 23%. About one third of children with the borderline intellectual uh, functioning may have Comorbid neuro neuropsychiatric disorder, uh, the most common being uh, attention deficit hyperactivity disorder and autism spectrum disorder. These comorbid uh, disorders can aggravate uh, problems in adaptive functioning and hinder the development. Furthermore, these uh, children are more likely to grow up uh, in lower socioeconomic background, backgrounds and face adversity which are factors associated with the poor mental health in the general population. Furthermore, children with beef find a primary cognitive deficit in working memory. Such um, impaired working memory in children with beef and neuropsychiatric disorders are related to poor adaptive behavior, increased vulnerability uh, to academic and social impairments, and uh, reduced quality of life. Therefore, it uh, appears to be a health mental condition that requires specific, specific health, educational and legal attention, having a serious of cognitive executive dysfunction associated with uh, it. In this slide, I show you the graphic distribution of the AQ and the classification table of, of the AQ scores. Uh, we can see uh, what uh, was said a little while ago, uh, namely that uh, the beef has an incidence of between uh, 14 and 23 percent uh, of the population. Borderline intellectual functioning identify a very complex clinical dimension. However, despite the complexity and the size of the population concerned, Research on idiopathic beef is very scarce as it is considered an underestimated problem. In fact, uh, here is the distribution of the AQ in the European pediatric population, which corresponds to uh, an uh, incidence of about 23%. Uh, and uh, here is it uh, in the general world population. According to the studies uh, that have so far treated this condition, the beef describes uh, a risk factor uh, and not a disease. Here uh, are some the key points of what has been said that, uh, that the beef is a diagnosis of because in the SM5 without the need for deficit in adaptive functioning. The diagnosis of borderline intellectual functioning as a diagnosis of because is a problematic is problematic. Subjects with beef do not have specific or identifying uh, phenotypic traits and do not uh, have biological or instrumental markers for a etiological diagnosis. For these uh, reasons, people with beef go um, unnoticed and their school failure can meet with the misunderstanding on the part of uh, teacher and uh, parents. In this perspective, uh, the consensus conference on the beef defi defined 
it uh, uh, has a health condition that uh, requires uh, particular attention in the health, educational and legal uh, fields. People with beef has, have uh, adaptive uh, functioning deficit and should be considered um, intellectual uh, disabled, disabled on the basis of their deficit despite, despite, despite uh, AQ score higher that, uh, than 75. Um, it is proposed to eliminate uh, the category of borderline intellectual dis dis deficit and to increase the diagnosis of intellectual disability in, in DSM-5 because people with BIF have uh, adaptive uh, functioning deficit that meet uh, uh, the criteria of uh, this DSM-5. Therefore, uh, the, ch the ch child population with BIF is more vulnerable than uh, the general population, which uh, is we, uh, the challenge of obtaining an uh, early diagnosis, a psychopathological assessment, and uh, an assessment of the specific learning potential in these cases has been posted. Uh, individuals with beef need uh, support that uh, facilitates uh, sports, uh, work, and social adaptation, and in some cases, uh, specific health care. The, the difficulties of legal and administrative accessibility uh, encouraged by the population with beef determine a need for help that needs to be concorrected. Con it is necessary to encourage research on the different aspects of beef from the health, social, educational level, and legal points of view. Therefore, this condition represents a psychiatric emergency. Over the years, there has been a revaluation re in the classification and uh, definition of a borderline intellectual functioning. Beef uh, is a complex diagnostic construct. Uh, in 1952, DSM defined beef um, as a mild uh, mental defici deficiency uh, and a Q score on, of, uh, um, of one or two standard deviation below the mean associated uh, with the cultural uh, psychology. Uh, Cycle and emotional impairment. In 1980, the SMH coded uh, um, beef as the code to indicate uh, other condition, conditions that may be a focus of clinical attention, relational, uh, occupational, or phases, uh, a phase uh, of life problems. For over three, uh, 30 years, the beef classification has not changed, and uh, uh, the DSM-3, DSM-4, and DSM-TR uh, have used the, the previously uh, assigned because in the SM5, the AQ boundaries from the diagnostic classification of the beef uh, have uh, been removed, apparently, with no criteria provided to exactly. Uh, defined the beef. Uh, although, according to the DSM find and the ICD, the HM beef should not be classified and as a disorder. Despite receiving a little at attention in research, beef uh, people appear as a vulnerable group from uh, an early age. Beef uh, adolescents seem to be more vulnerable to mental diseases such as uh, uh, post-traumatic uh, uh, stress uh, uh, disorder, substance misuse and abuse, uh, and personality um, disorder than adolescents with normal range AQ scores. Uh, beef has been identified as a relevant risk factor for suicide uh, among uh, pre-adolescents and uh, adults. Beef adults may present relevant problems or adaptive uh, functioning, uh, cycle problems, uh, poverty, and difficulties in several areas um, of daily life activities. Um, more ma mothers of uh, beef children, uh, compared with the parents uh, of children with uh, normal EQ, showed uh, poor parenting. Uh, little uh, positive involve involvement and the higher stress level uh, levels. Uh, regarding research on uh, pathogenesis, uh, there are some studies that have uh, proposed uh, causes 
In fact, the borderline intellectual functioning can cause sleep disorder, obstructive um, sleep apnea syndrome mode disorder, psychosis, and ADHD. Uh, however, there are also genetic syndromes that can uh, case uh, borderline intellectual functioning and the main, uh, the main syndromes involved are listed uh, below. Nono syndrome, uh, William syndrome, uh, Turner syndrome. Um, among the few studies uh, carried out on, the, on this condition, the, the most uh, recent uh, regarding um, the possible etiopathogenesis uh, highlights a macrostructural alteration of the subject with BIP compared to control, in particular, a reduction in total zip time, an increase in stage shift an increase in waking uh, time after sleeping in initiation, a reduction in sleep, in sleep uh, stage two, an increase in slow wave, wave sleep, and ultimately uh, a reduction in REM sleep. We can graphically uh, summarize the macrostructural difference of sleep in subjects with the beef compared to health subjects. As a, or for the graphic uh, comparison, uh, com comparison uh, this is the complexed spectral analysis. Phase two of the sleep um, monitored at the same time. This is the difference between a normal subject and the subject with this. This is the difference in slow wave sleep uh, between normal subject and the subject with this. This is the difference in REM phase between normal subject and subject with BIP. As shown in the data of uh, macrostructure, in this table, there is, in, is uh, um, instead the analysis of the microstructure of sleep, which uh, highlights how the sequences repeated during uh, the non REM phases are more reduced. A reduction uh, A1 emerges compared to the control graph, uh, and the less A1 the subject produces, uh, the worse the sleep will be. This data show that sleep deprivation is constant in deep. Uh, here uh, we uh, come um, to talk about uh, our study. The aim of this study was uh, to evaluate the perceived parental stress level among mothers of children with uh, borderline intellectual functioning. It is a retrospective observation case control uh, study involving 107 subjects uh, with uh, 62 males and 45 females uh, with the BIP, uh, many age 10, and uh, 100 in seven developing uh, children uh, with uh, 63 males and 44 female um, age mean nine. We were recruited and statistically compared, uh, comparable for age for age and six, and, six. Uh, and all uh, mothers completed the parenting stress index scale to assess the perceived stress. Um, the subjects of uh, both uh, groups, uh, Bill and Control, were recruited in the Child Neuropsychiatric Unit of the University of Campania with Giovanni Vitelli. The Italian version of the Parenting Stress Index, short version, was uh, used for the evaluation of parental stress. It is a standard, a standard, standardized self-administration questionnaire that provides a score uh, on three different scales, parental distress, parent-child interaction, difficult child. The parental distress scale evaluates uh, the parent uh, stress. Um, the parent child interaction subscale evaluates the stress caused by uh, the parent child interaction. The difficult child subscale measures the stress of managing a child who appears to be more problematic than the parent expected. Uh, PSA, uh, the PSA has 36 elements based on uh, a five points Likert li scale. The subscale scores uh, range from 12 to 60, and the total uh, stress score range from 36 and 180. The higher the sc uh, score is, the greater the parental stress uh, level, uh, level uh, high internal consistency. 
we can uh, um, does uh, summarize the different skills of the user's test. So we have a parental distress with um, 12 items. It defini defines uh, the level of distress received by the parent, dysfunctional parent-child interaction with the 12 items focused on the parent's perception of the child not responding to their expectation. Difficult child with 12 items focused on some fundamental uh, characteristics of uh, the child's behavior that make uh, it easy or difficult to manage and uh, which often originate in the child's uh, behavior. Total PSC uh, stress are set of items uh, that provide an indication of the overall level, uh, level of uh, parental stress. For the comparison of the parametric variables, uh, variables the differences were expressed uh, as, me as means and standard deviation of the results obtained uh, by the two graphs according to the distribution key students test or the key square test for, for non-parametric variables, uh, value of uh, p-value um, uh, lower than uh, 0.05, uh, uh, were considered statistically significant uh, to verify the effect of the analysis, the calculation of the according of the according to coin. Uh, and the results were was uh, carried out. Um, uh, I am now showing you the results from uh, an American uh, um, point of view. The table uh, shows the results of the comparison with between uh, children with beef and control subject on the parental stress index uh, short form scale. As can be seen, uh, the scores are all statistically significant uh, with a particular, uh, particularly high, um, like uh, uh, Cohen D. Uh, these are the same results from a graphical point of view. Uh, as with uh, many study, studies, uh, uh, there are limits and uh, strings. String. Uh, the limitation uh, where the lack of uh, specific rehab intervention, the lack of specific parent training, and the lack of follow-up. Uh, while the strings uh, were originality and novelty and sample population, we can uh, therefore summarize, uh, summarize uh, that uh, the difficult child rating scale takes uh, into account uh, not only the stress attributable to the difficulties in managing emotional, behavioral, socially, and scholastic problems evidently found in with children. The parent-child dysfun uh, dysfunctional interaction scales, scale assesses uh, perceived uh, difficulties uh, in the in interaction related to the representation of a child mismatch with the expectation of the mothers. Fear that uh, the child would never reach uh, the standards uh, of the of his uh, peers finds uh, its way into the parents' importance and influence of parenting still for the uh, psychodevelopment uh, uh, evolution of vulnerable or uh, at risk children. Most parents of deaf uh, children report a high rate of stress. Also, um, due to the decisions they have uh, to make every day in managing the child, uh, their child and their problems. And uh, uh, finally, uh, the parent, uh, the parental distress um, scale denotes dissatisfaction with the parental role and sets off on an alarm bell uh, because uh, indicative of possible dysfunctional behavior on the part of the parents. Parental stress can also have a negative influence on the child's uh, development. In summary, parental style and borderline intellectual functioning involves uh, increased care needs, uh, research in constraint, uh, fin uh, financial problems, parenting stress, impaired interaction per parent-child 
also like, uh, linked uh, to the um, adaptive and executive difficulties that the child par uh, presents, uh, lack, uh, lack of information on the child's uh, condition can lead the, the family to fall back on, on their uh, own feelings of uh, helplessness and pessimism, coping methods centered on negative emotion, directives, uh, and negative feedback to their children, authoritarian and less supportive style. Uh, all uh, of these causes uh, a greater uh, release uh, from stress on the part of, of the family. I it was found that early intervention and the prevention in the population at the risk of delay have um, shown a positive uh, effects on the longer term change of the infant with clear evidence of a beneficial uh, impact on mother infant interaction. Uh, therefore, it is uh, important uh, to envisage a multimodal uh, approach with interventions in uh, support of multimodality aimed at increasing the sense of self-esteem and self-efficacy of parents, as well as inserting, to, inserting the basis of, uh, for a positive therapeutic alliance helping to reduce the level of stress and having parents a positive relief, not only on the well-being of adults, parents, but also on the condition of the children. Thank you. Uh, 